Alright everyone, and welcome back to That Variety Nerd. I'm Christina, and today we are diving back into more of this good old moving on up challenge. So Max has decided he apparently hates us now, um, after we tried to woo him in the last episode. Um, obviously the evil trait uh, that can lead to master manipulation. Lexi failed to encrypt all the files in time, so we got paid 37 simoleons for the two files that we got to. And there's our good pal, Nicholas Lothario. Good old Nicholas. Like, he's been, like, the real MVP. But anyway, around, uh, we finally furnished our wonderful apartment. Um, and now we can actually go ahead and try to save up to move. Maybe we'll adjust some of the furnishings a little bit. But for right now, we're going to go ahead and chat with Nicholas Lothario. He's already nearby. Well, apparently this thing is telling me otherwise. Oh, okay. Hi, Nicholas Lothario. What's up? And plus, Nicholas, like, we know a little bit about him, I think, right? Yeah, so we know that he's a dog lover. He's also unemployed. He's a romantic. That's kind of cool. Okay. Dog lover, romantic. All right. He's got some redeeming qualities. That's awesome. I'm guessing he got the romantic trait from Don, possibly, even though he's the serial romantic and all that. But um, this episode, we're going to focus on getting to know Nicholas a little bit more. Uh, maybe he's our potential suitor. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Uh, but we'll just go steady with Nicholas um, and go from there. So I don't know um, how everything's going to go. Uh, we just suck at conversation on this game. Like, that's just how the cookie's crumbling. That's why we have so many just, like, moms. Like, we don't have any, like, two parents or anything like that. Because, like, they are strong, independent women. And, like, conversations and trying to get with somebody in this game is hard. Uh, so Nicholas is actually single, so that's great. We'll discuss neighborhood changes. We've got a pleasant conversation. We'll talk about handiness. We're not going to screw this up, my dudes. We're not going to screw this up. But yes, welcome back. Welcome back to That Variety Nerd. I'm Christina. And as always, get your choice of beverage. Today we've got some good old Kentucky ginger ale on, well, in the bottle. I almost said on tap, but that's beer. <laughs> Either way around. Um, so they're just going to continue to chat. Worst case scenario, they're just like really good friends. And you know what? Who doesn't like a good friend, right? Right. But I think it's like, you know, it's time for Lexi to move forth in the challenge. And I forgot to set a timer because I'm dumb. Uh, either way around, I hope you all are having a wonderful day so far. I will have a deep conversation. Last about day, like we're just going to continue to go from there. We'll tell a funny story. Pleasant conversation. So all is going well. We'll tell an engaging story. We'll gossip about the neighbors. Like, how's your dad doing? <laughs> to be fair, it doesn't surprise me that Don Lothario has a kid. It really doesn't. Um, but let's discuss interests. Like, we're really doing alright. Like, Nicholas and, you know, Lexi, you're doing alright. Which is always a good thing, right? Right. We'll give him our apartment key because, like, you know what? We're good enough friends with him, and we trust him, and he's our neighbor, slash seem to be ex-neighbor. Okay, so either way around, uh, we're going to go ahead and get some leftovers. Uh, we're going to get our fun up just by watching some TV while we eat. And then I think we're going to take a look at the next sort of gigs. So we're not going to go with the encryption data just yet. Um, We'll do temporary modding contract. I think that's reasonable. Chat with client and mod game. Okay, I think that's reasonable. I think we can do that, right? Right. So we're going to go ahead and chat with the client, right? And then we're going to go ahead and work on mod Sims Forever. So that's exciting. All right. So either way around, I hope you all are having a wonderful day. I hope you are just chilling, relaxing, enjoying your choice of beverage with this video. Again, I'm really excited for the fall and just seeing where this challenge is going to go because for me this challenge, it's sort of like, it's gone in 10 different directions and now we have something that's like halfway normal that I'm kind of on board with, but I'm also like, where's the weird stuff that we've had as like the charm of the series? But either way around, uh, we're doing stuff that's a little bit different, at least within each generation. For example, Christine did most of her stuff through painting, uh, Lexi's doing her, she's no, Max, you're being a jerk and spreading false information about us. Seriously, like that happened. But um, as you can see, Lexi, she's just, she's just enjoying herself. She's doing all right. Um, so now this episode, we're actually going to try to save up to move on up into the next apartment. 
Um, hopefully we'll get some decent neighbors again because Nicholas and Don have been just a trip. But in like the best way possible. Some neighbors are just terrible. Some neighbors are like the absolute greatest people ever. So yeah, there's that. Either way around, I hope you all are enjoying yourselves and having a wonderful day. Uh, either way around, we're going to go ahead and work on our modding gig because it's another 800 simoleons. I mean, 800. I don't know why we got 800. Well, to be fair, we'll probably end up at 800 simoleons, but yeah. So we're going to go ahead and start working on the next gig. We'll get some posters while we're at it. Uh, we'll go ahead and chat with the client first. We'll go get the posters. Then we're going to come back up and mod The Sims game forever, whatever it's called. I've lost track. It's fine. Either way around. Uh, we chat. We chatted with the client. So the gig payout is 485 simoleons, which is quite great. So we'll just see how it goes from there. Who's sleeping on the bench? Like, I can't tell who that is. And I feel bad for them. Okay, so we got one poster down. Which is 200 simoleons. Also, we're taking the laptop with us. So just as like full disclosure, because it's sort of what she's just trying to do. Oh yeah, we also need to go ahead and go get some snow globes while we're at it too, before we go into our wonderful modding career. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and mod Sims Forever as our second objective, so hopefully we can finish this gig early and go from there. So that'll be nice and exciting. Uh, so uh, we're going to go ahead and sell the snow globe, or whatever we got. I don't know. Okay, piano, volume three, concertos, minutes, minutes, and sonatas. So somehow we got an extra 250 simoleons from like a book, which I find mildly entertaining. So we could very well be moving on up like as soon as possible. Like I'm not even joking when I say that. But we'll have her use the bathroom. We'll have her get a shower in. We'll have her get some sleep, and then we're going to just crank out. You know, we're gonna we're, we're gonna do some grinding today, people. We're transitioning into a brand new apartment with brand new adventures, brand new neighbors. Even though we're back into the spice market again, so get excited about that. Um, I'm excited for this. It's more of a transitiony sort of an episode, but I'm here for it at the same time. But yeah, Lexi's just finishing up her little job. Technically, it's not due until like. Sunday morning, but you know what? Like, we're going to need it. We're going to need it, my dudes. We're going to need it. Uh, we also got some more posters over here, so once we wake up, uh, we'll go get some poster action going, or at least get one poster going, uh, and we'll go from there. So again, I hope you all are enjoying this series so far. I sure am, and we're just going to continue to work on this and just move on up in the world. So, yeah, on that happy note, I think Lexi is almost done with her job. You've got this, my home skillet. <laughs> so, home skillet, I think, originally came from what show? Arthur? Oh, okay, 582 simoleons. The mod was very timely delivered. The modding group was so relieved that they gave Lexi a bit extra. Now everyone can enjoy their vacations in peace, sort of. Unfortunately, the missing modder still hasn't been... <laughs> oh, God, that's actually really funny. Okay, so... Game plan is that we're going to go use the bathroom, we're going to get our needs freshened up a little bit more, and then uh, we're going to go collect a poster, and then I think we'll have enough to move. Possibly. We shall see. Either way around, uh, we'll be back in just a minute. Alright, friendos, we are back. So as you can see, I actually sort of changed up this room a little bit. So we're down to 320 simoleons left, but you know what, 1300 is not going to be too, too bad to accomplish so that way we can move. Hopefully at the end of this episode, and then that way we can transition into a brand new apartment, and we'll go from there. Uh, Nicholas, Lothario, you literally live next door. Right, so that's another 65 simoleons, and then we got more coming up. Okay, we got another 200 simoleons, so that's neat. And then, do we got any snow globes? Okay, we do not have snow globes. Uh, so what we can do, uh, let's try to start maybe another new job, maybe, let's hope. If not, we'll go to the park and get more posters. So, alright, so the spreadsheet person one we could probably do, crypto simming, that sounds a lot. Um, we could do the mod one again, because that one was pretty easy. 
Uh, so let's try the llama con or the llama corn llama corn list serve security. Let's try that one. So we're gonna study security systems, and this one pays 435 simoleons. So we'll at least be on track there. I'm trying to avoid loading screens as much as possible because, like, they're just very slow in this game. Or at least I've gotten slower, unless if I'm just dumb. I don't know. We're going to go ahead and study the security systems. Uh, we'll go ahead and hack the hosting service. Actually, let's go get some food in our system before we hack. Uh, so once we're done studying the security systems, we're going to go ahead and get some food in our system. And then we're going to hack the hosting service. And then we will write report. So we got until 9 a.m. on Monday, but you know what? All is well, right? Right. So yeah, this is pretty much what we've got for our bedroom. Again, not necessarily ideal, but you know what? All is well. Uh, so yeah, we're trying to get our simoleons up to 1,600. That's the goal for this episode because that's how much we need to move. And we'll just go from there. So we'll clean out the spoiled food afterwards. Uh, we'll clean out that. We will clean that up as well. So we've got a lot to accomplish. Uh, and yeah, so again, I hope you all are enjoying this series so far. Uh, I sure am. This is probably my favorite series. <laughs> Just because I have so much fun recording it, and I have so much fun playing it with y'all, and that's all that matters. Either way around, uh, we're going to go ahead and start to work on this new job that we've got as our for the freelance programming stuff. Max, you said some deep doo-doo about us. We are no longer friends with you. Because, like, we do not need, like, toxic stuff in our lives, right? Right. Uh, but, again, I hope you all are having a wonderful day so far, wherever you are in the world. Um, we're just sort of chilling, relaxing, playing some games. Alright, so we'll have you just clean up everything once you're done hacking the hosting service. So, it says under study security systems use a computer to remotely study the client security systems and find attack vectors located under the freelancer category oh nice we got an extra 72 simoleons too nice so hack hosting service using the security vulnerabilities that Lexi identified use a computer to hack into the client's hosting services located under the freelancer category and then use a computer to write a security report that outlines the client security holes so yeah oh wow we even got booted from the club Wow, okay. Well, I feel like, to be fair, like, Max is just a turd sandwich anyway, and, like, like Lexi deserves better. Oh, okay, cool. We'll get, we'll hang out with Nicholas once we're done writing this report. Uh, so we'll go ahead, uh, we'll agree to hang out. Uh, we'll give him the key. That way he can just come and hang out whenever. So yeah, we're just finishing up this report really quickly. Seriously, dude? I'm like finishing up the report here. Like, this is work stuff. But well, we got 657 simoleons, which is great. We need less than a thousand to go. Acquired the writing skill. Lexi's newly acquired writing skill will allow her to enjoy the benefits of expanded vocabulary and grammatically correct sentences. So we'll see how it goes. But uh, let's take a look and see if we got some more posters. We do. So we've got another poster over here. And then hopefully we have another one over here. Yeah, we do. So we got a couple more posters to collect. Oh, all right. Who's doing the do over there? I need answers. I need answers. Probably Don. Let's be real. It's going to be Don Lothario. Noisy neighbors from neighbor situation. Oh, Jesus. Okay. 522 simoleons. The contract at Llama Corn was thrilled with the early report delivery. Lexi received a good bit more a good bit more pay than she was expecting, but no complaints here. So sooner rather than later, we're going to get this all taken care of. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and sell this for 65 simoleons. And then we're going to go ahead and sell this for another 65 simoleons. So we got like 300 to go. Uh, so we'll go ahead and get some leftover cake. All right, let's see what we got here. Well, a lot of these we can't do because we don't have the programmer skill to do so. So we're going to go ahead and just do the mod makers jam one again. Because that way we'll have enough simoleons to really, like, make this work. And we'll have enough to move. And then that way, again, we're taking the computer with us, which I don't know if we're allowed to do or not, but it's fine. I mean, everything's fine. 
Uh, so yeah, we'll at least be able to move at the end of this episode, which is quite exciting. Uh, we might have enough time to actually um, get some more grinding in and get some more work done. So we'll see how it goes. But for right now, Lexi's just enjoying her meal. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and chat with the client really quickly, and then she'll go ahead and start modding her game. So that'll be nice and exciting. And then we will be back once she is done with this odd job, just because we've already sort of seen it before. Um, and that way we can, you know, pick up some steam and hopefully have enough to sort of start getting settled into this next apartment. All right, dear friends. So we have enough money to move officially, which is quite exciting. Uh, we're going to top off our needs really quickly before we go ahead and go for the big move. So we're going to eat some cake, watch a little bit of TV. We're going to sleep. Uh, we're also going to move the computer into our inventory which I realize could be cheating possibly, but you know what, like, I feel like all the rules have just sort of been out the window at this point. And then we're gonna get some grinding in to get some basics on the apartment. So get excited about that. Very much a transition-y sort of episode, but you know what, it all works out. So that's all that matters. Uh, but yeah, we're getting our needs up really quickly uh, before we dive into anything else. Uh, so get excited about that. Um, again, I hope you all are enjoying the series so far. I sure am. And yeah, again, we're going to top off our needs really quickly, and then we're going to move, so get excited about that. All right, friends, so we are back. We are going to set the money at zero. And we are officially in our wonderful new home. Uh, so we have this huge thing. Again, we can't change the number of bedrooms, etc. So we're, quite frankly, just going to leave it as is, in my opinion. Uh, so this apartment over here is actually where Christine lived until her passing. And then next door, um, that's where her and Lyle live. So again, this is our new little humble abode over here. We got a one bedroom over here. We got a nice view of the good old spice market. Uh, we can technically adjust things as needed, but okay, any decent posters have already been grabbed. Yeah, I get the feeling we're gonna be stuck in that position, but it's gonna be, we're gonna be fine, fam. We're gonna be just fine. So either way around, uh, what we're gonna do is actually, Um, okay, well, we can at least grab a snow globe or whatever is going to be in there. And we'll go from there. So we're just getting our bare basics for right now. We're going to get like a little bit of a cot, like some sort of, we're going to at least get like the plumbing and stuff first. So we got a whopping 20 simoleons, which is quite great. Um, I love the sarcasm in my tone right there. Whopping. Okay, we got another one over here, so we're going to go try over here. Uh, and then we might travel to the park and just keep on grinding the rest of this episode. That's just what this rest of this episode is going to be. We're just going to be grinding until we get a lot of simoleons and just try to get as many as we can from the different neighborhoods. So get excited about that, and at least you all don't have to sit through the loading screens like I do. All right, people, we are back. So we're officially in winter, I think, now? Oh, we're halfway through winter. That explains why we've been wearing all this wintry stuff for the last little bit of time here. So again, we're going to just finish up this episode just grinding. We're literally just going to be grinding to the point where we're just... Seriously, any decent posters have been already been taken. Jerks. Okay, well, either way around, uh, we've got frogs that we can go after. So we've got some frogs over here. Don't you worry, don't you worry my dude. We're going to be working on your ish soon. So we got some more froggies over here. I feel like we got more frogs like somewhere, but I don't know offhand. Okay, well we can dig over here at least. And then who's this person over here? I don't know who they are, but they seem pretty cool. Uh, let's see what we got here. To be fair, you never know who you're gonna meet at the park. That's just a given. Uh, so yeah, while she's out and about collecting things, um, and we're trying to maybe get her fishing skill up ideally, but we'll just see how it goes. Um, again, it looks like there are posters, but there are not. Alright, so we got a new frog from what it looks like. Uh, can we do anything else, really? Because we can't really grab any posters. I'm guessing that's going to just be the thing for a little bit. Um, okay, we got another frog over here, so that's neat. We have some digging action going on. We'll breed frogs with the Sun Surfer frog. All right, so we got 20 simoleons there. Uh, we'll extract the fossil. That's worth another 45. 
And anything and everything is going to help us out in the long run. That's just how I see it. Oh, Christine, I miss you. All right, so we're going to go over here. We're going to get some more fishing accomplished as well. All right, so we got a hypno frog and a sun server frog. So we'll try to breed those, see what happens. And then worst case scenario, like we can just sell the two frogs. She's just like, I just quit. I hate this. But she also looks like super focused at the same time. We're just, we're waiting until we can breed the two frogs, I think. Which is going to be quite great. Uh, okay, this angle is obviously not ideal. But I want to just check it out a little bit more. That way we could get some more accomplished in this episode. Again, we're going to be grinding a little bit more. And just get that grind on. Okay, cool. We can grab posters again from what it looks like. Which is quite great. And that's something that we need it. Okay, Nicholas, you had your chance for right now. Okay, well, that was good time. That was good timing. So we're going to go get the posters uh, per usual as our routine. And we're just going to continue to go forth, uh, get our poster action going on. And we'll just go from there. So that way, can we breed now? Okay, I guess not. Anyway, Ren, we're going to go ahead and sell these frogs. So we've got 25 simoleons here. And we've got 125 here, so that's neat. And then we got another 120 from this poster. So yeah, Lexi's just going slowly but surely. We're grinding. We're grinding her down to a nub, but you know what? It's going to be worth it once we are fully settled in. I don't anticipate us to be in this next apartment long because it's just a, it's downgraded from a one bedroom to, I mean, to a one bedroom from a, a, um, we're downgrading from a two bedroom to a one bedroom. So it's not going to take us like as long because we're not going to need as much stuff. We're not going to need to cover as much ground. So there's that. Uh, but yeah, we have a whopping total of 815 simoleons, which is quite exciting. Oh, Jesus. Okay, we are back, party people. We are back. So, uh, welcome back. Um, we are at the Romance Festival, which is, I believe, back in the fashion district, so we can easily get some posters while we're here. Um, or so I hope, if we haven't taken them all already. Um, okay, it's really hard to tell where everything's at. So we're just going to be here. Or at the very least, we're going to get some poster action happening. Uh, let's see here. We can get some gardening stuff, possibly. I don't know. Um, so Lexi's really tired, uh, but we got ourselves another 200 simoleons. Again, we're grinding this episode. That's just how the cookie's about to crumble. Um, if Lexi doesn't crumble first. Uh, but uh, let's see if we can get some food in our systems. Uh, we'll go ahead and get some ramen. Because who doesn't like a nice good bowl of ramen on a cold day? And just bowl of soup in general. And noodles and all that stuff. Uh, so Lexi is officially at 1,080 simoleons, which is great. We've got a solid start on this first day in this new apartment. Again, we're probably not going to spend a whole lot of time in this one. Again, I say that for probably every single episode, but it's fine. Everything's fine. Uh, but we're just going to hang out and chill and just enjoy our ramen. That's just how we are a rolling, a rocking and rolling, a ramen and rolling. Ha! Okay, that was really bad. I'll shut up now. That was just bad. That was just objectively bad. But yeah, either way around, uh, we got ourselves some good progress accomplished. We got Lexi some food. She'll probably pass out like any second now, but it's fine. Everything's fine. So, uh, we're just sort of waiting for Lexi to finish up with her food at the Romance Festival. I like her hair. And we'll just go from there. So, again, um, we're going to end this episode um, pretty shortly. We'll go back home. Uh, I'll go off screen for just a couple minutes and start to renovate the place a little bit more. And we'll go from there. So get excited about that, people. Get excited about that. All right. So we are back. Um, so, Lexi, I think uh, we should be able to... Oh, I was going to say we should be able to get some more posters. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and... I don't know where I'm going with this. Oh yeah, I was going to say, I'm going to go ahead and start uh, renovating the apartment a little bit more. And we'll go from there. 
All right, so before Lexi goes off to bed and before we end this episode, that's basically what I did. We got a shower and we got a bed. So on that happy note, thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, please stay tuned for some more good old moving on up challenge goodness. And uh, please like, subscribe, comment, all of that fun YouTube stuff. I also stream on Twitch on Tuesdays and Wednesdays, so get excited about that. Either way around, I hope you all are having a wonderful day so far. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe, all of that fun stuff, and I will see you all later. Bye, everyone.